Premier League Week 30 preview. Saturday the 30th of March 2024. Match day one. Newcastle United versus West Ham United taking place at St James's Park with a kickoff time of 12.30. Newcastle team news. Sandro Tonelli is still suspended. Joe Linton, Nick Pope and Callum Wilson remain sidelined. Sven Botman is added to the injury list with his second knee injury of the season. Lewis Miley is out for about six weeks with a back problem. However, Harvey Barnes, T. Noor, Liveramento and Kieran Trippier should make a return for Newcastle. West Ham team news. There's no significant new injuries, but Emerson, Palmieri and Maxwell Cornet will be assessed. Despite the injury woes, I predict a 3-1 victory for Newcastle in a closely contested game. Match game two is Sheffield United versus Fulham taking place at Bramall Lane with a kickoff time of 3 o'clock. Sheffield United are expecting to be without a few players. Mason Holgate for his suspension, ankle and thigh issues for Cameron Archer. Uh, Anis Ben Slimani are questionable. Fulham have no injury worries. Both teams are expected to play out a 0-0 ball draw. Match 3 we have Tottenham Hotspurs taking on Luton in a London derby at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium with a kickoff time of 3 o'clock. Tottenham Hotspurs are expected to have Mickey van der Ven as their only injury worry with a hamstring strain. Luton are expected to have Mads Anderson, Alfie Doherty and Alba Samba Lakonga back. The game is expected to be an entertaining Affair with both scoring a couple of goals each, ending in 2 2 draw. Chelsea versus Burnley will take place at Stamford Bridge with a kickoff time of 3 o'clock. Minor doubts over Cole Palmer and Malmo Gusto, whilst long term injuries to Romeo Lavia and Rhys James, who are still unavailable, Enzo Fernandez is expected to return. Burnley are expected to be without. Fafana, who's ineligible, and Lyle Foster will replace him up front. I expect Chelsea to win this one comfortably 3 0. Match 5, where you have Bournemouth taking on Everton at the Vitality Stadium at 3 o'clock. Calvin Lewin, Patterson, and Coleman are still out for Everton. Marcus Tavernier, Ryan Fredericks, and Junior Stanislas are suspended. Still out for Bournemouth. Everton should win this one in a tough game by the narrowest of margins of 2 1. Nottingham Forest versus Crystal Palace is match 6, taking part at the city ground at 3 o'clock. There's an injury worry to Chris Coleman and Tiwa Awane. Palace have in major injuries to Sam Johnson. Michael Elise and Jake Degore. I expect this match to be an entertaining score draw. Aston Villa versus Wolverhampton Wanderers takes part at Villa Park with a 5.30 kickoff. Villa have Emi Buendia out, Tyron Mings out, and Bubakar Kamara out also. Wolves have a couple of players missing in Pedro Neto and He Chan Wang. I tip Villa to win this derby game 2 1. Match 8, we see Bournemouth taking on Manchester United at the GTEC Community Stadium at 8 o'clock. The only suspension for Brentford is Sergio Regulon, replaced by Keen Lewis Potter. Man United have noticeable absences in Maguire, Johnny Evans and Casemiro and Ahmad Diallo is suspended. Man United should win this with, but make tough work of it 2-1. Sunday the 31st of March 2024 games we have Liverpool versus Brighton and North Albion at Anfield with a 2 o'clock kickoff. Liverpool are expected to be without Andrew Robertson, 
but Curtis Jones and Darwin Nunes should return. Brighton are expected to have James Milner and Wow Pedro back. I forecast Liverpool to win this one comfortably 4-1. And then the headline game of the weekend, which match 10, we see Manchester City take on Arsenal at Etihad Stadium with a 4.30 kickoff. Manchester City have a few injury concerns in Kevin De Bruyne and Kyle Walker. Arsenal have injury doubts over the Gabriel Martinelli. I expect City to win this title clash quite comfortably 3-1. Please like, share and subscribe and leave your comments below.